Creating foundation, what do we do? We invest in future leaders. And this last one, I want us to make a funny face and funny gesture. Okay, you yell it and say that. Create a foundation, what do you do? And we say, we invest in future leaders. <laughs> On behalf of the founder of Creative Foundation and all the me uh, board members, I say congratulations. Thank you for inviting me, my dear French chairman, uh, Issa Kimbolaji, to come and uh, talk briefly to you guys. Anyway, I'm very impressed, and I'm just here to encourage you a little bit with you guys that uh, what you guys are doing now is really nice, especially in this country. Because we've been here, like, one of you won't be here for a long time, over 40 years, so we don't have something like this. And it would have been nice to have something like this in those days for our youth, for our kids. So we have a lot of youth get into trouble all over the place. I've been in government for a while too, for a long time. I'm, I'm actually impressed to see you guys here. This, today is Saturday. You guys show up. And the last time I came to Creative Foundation, you guys were doing some presentation. That's another very impressive thing. I saw some kids coming up. Um, been willing to come out and ask questions. I think we have Professor Aluko giving a uh, speech at that time. And I was, I see the interaction and I said, this is really good. And uh, kudos to the, the representative and organizers for this creative foundation. I'm not gonna take too much of your time, but we have another guest.
I like the food there, I like the gym, I like everything about it. I rate this a 10 out of 10. Uh, uh, my, my, uh, I liked food, I liked it here, like, I rated like a 9 out of 10. The food was good, and like, playing at the gym was fun. Uh, I liked it here, uh, and everyone was fun, it was, I, I enjoyed seeing everyone having fun. The food was amazing, and the gym was fun. I read this event fun and educated for kids and it's also a physical event where we exercise our body 
and where we also learn education and stuff from the event. And we learned about art and how to use um, art to do to make art. Um, so, um, my experience today was amazing. Um, I had a lot of fun and we did a lot of amazing things like going to the gym and playing games. Um, my best part is that when we went to the gym, the past meeting, and we had diversity of like sports that we have to choose and play. That was fun for me. And the act part where we had to like paint the design we want. And yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. This place is very fun. It has lots of food and drinks and um, everybody's very nice and peaceful. So, I rated a 10 out of 10. It is now a pleasure to welcome you to the best in future leaders. Production I'm doing today. I'm performing to a music that's already recorded by an artist. And sometimes we can fuse it together when you don't have those type of abilities. And now, and, and that's what I want to do. Another thing about the future of black artists art is not just entertainment, it's a way we can tell instruction, story, and even instruct our children. My performance today is called Olari Wadi. Actually, a father talking to his son that you're going to face a lot of things in life. 
but you have to take it easy. You're going to face a lot of disappointment in life, but you have to take it easy. Now, this is all I reward you. Already stretched, or you can make them by yourself. What you need, very simple. Uh, you need canvas fabric. You need something called stretcher bars, a pair of scissors. So the canvas bars have two sides. There's a beveled edge, and there's a flat uh, surface. The canvas front will stay on the beveled edge. So it's pretty intuitive. You will just connect them like so. Um, okay, it's going well so far. Alright, then the final side, you pull. There we go, guys. This you can use to create any of these paintings you see around here. Thank you. 